Hello everyone. Welcome back to my channel and today in this video we are going to discuss about a topic layers of earth. And this topic can be taken as notes and I hope for every student this will be useful. So let's get started. Coming to the little introduction, the earth can be divided into several layers based on their composition, physical properties and behavior. and these layers include the crust mantle and core now let us discuss three three layers one by one and here i mentioned each and every point very simply that every student can understand coming to the first one crust it is the outermost layer of the earth and it is composed of solid rock the crust is further divided into two types Firstly, the continental crust, which is thicker and less dense, and secondly, the oceanic crust, which is thinner and denser. Coming to the second layer, mantle. It lies beneath the crust, and this layer extends up to a depth of about two thousand nine hundred and kilometers, and it is the thickest layer of the Earth. and represents about 84% of its total volume and this mantle is composed of solid rock but behaves like a viscous fluid over long time scales and this mantle layer is further divided into two types upper mantle and lower mantle coming to this upper mantle This upper mantle extends from the base of the crust to a depth of about 660 kilometers and it contains two regions the lithosphere and the asthenosphere The lithosphere is rigid and consists of the crust and uppermost part of the mantle and the asthenosphere is a partially molten plastic like layer that allows the lithosphere to move next coming to the lower mantle this lower mantle extends from a depth of about 660 km to the boundary with the outer core and it is the hotter and under greater pressure than the upper mantle and also The rock in this region which lies in the lower mantle is more solid and less deformable. Coming to the third layer, this layer core we are going to discuss into two types, outer core and inner core. Firstly, coming to this outer core, it is a liquid layer located between the mantle and the inner core. And this outer core extends from a depth of 2900 km to 5150 km and it is primarily composed of molten iron and nickel and is responsible for generating the earth's magnetic field through the process of convection lastly coming to this final part inner core it is the innermost layer of the earth and this inner core it extends from a depth of 5150 km to the center of the planet which is about 6371 km from the surface and it is a solid sphere composed mainly of iron and nickel despite extremely high temperatures the inner core remains solid due to the immense pressure exerted by the surrounding layers so this is all about a brief explanation and simple notes on the topic layers of earth and i hope you all might like this video and i will provide the pdf of this particular topic in the description and so if you want please go through and check it and any videos related to you please mention below in the comment section so that i will try to provide you the best content and thank you for watching please do support and encourage my channel thank you